sort of term. Um, but since the term will be malbish, all the nefesh and pamela the goof, it's in two madrayas, but Torah Chaim es Torah Chaim, and then es Hashem mamish. But that would tend to indicate two levels in the makif. The first of all, there's the makif of Torah mitzvahs, as they are muluboshim inside the dinim of the Torah, and they are chokmosiv atoimei shelakosh poken. But then there's the Indian of through them the vittel to Hashem mamish in his own essence. Es Hashem is like a further madrege, and that's what we call a makif arochek. It's called in so this makif akorev and makif arochek. It's what we might call in Kesa, the two Madrigas of Kesa, the Chitanias of the Kesa, which relates what Kesa is because connected with Torah and Mitzvahs. Uh, that's the, you know, which relates to us in a way that it, uh, it surrounds us. But then that brings us to a further surrounding from the Atzmi of Sarotzen of Torah uh, Chaim Es Hashem uh, Mamish. Uh, through that you become bottle uh, to a Kodesh Bohu. And therefore he says, And therefore he says, Now that appears um, um, also to be like a doubling up. We just said that. We just said that, that it, uh, the, the, the term Mitzvah Sam Malbishim Es Hashem so then it follows that if, if that's the case, then Hashem is mal makifu mal bisha mirei radlo. So I would suggest that that's the same deal uh, to what I pointed out. That in the first case, one could possibly assume that. The 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 pasuk in Shmuel that we just quoted, that, that is referring to a general makif on the part of Torah and Mitzvahs, which involves also a, a makif and a bitl to Hakadosh Baruch Es Hashem. Over here, he seems to be saying to him, only makifa u malbisha mirosh v'adraga. Now makifa means to surround and sort of malbish. So what is the difference? Well, a makif is something that surrounds you and the word makif refers like unlimitedly to the concept of a of a surrounding fort. The ilo, the ilo for malbis is the idea of an era thing which goes over you as a garment. But therefore my garments are also a makif on me, but they fit me more to my side. So that was what we did as the elder Rabbi is saying, that there's like two levels in the makif and that's what he's gonna say now. The Hare Kula Truva Tura, that's one Indian. Boer Hashem Mamish Makif U Malbisha, Meresha Va Adra Glo. That's what we just said. The Mesha Kosu Truri Exa, Ukasiv Katsina Rotsain Teatreno. Now these are two Psukim in, uh, in the Sefer Tilim. That, um, the, the first one is in. Uh, in um, um, Chapter 18, right at the beginning, where David Amalek says that in war the Abish has always been truly exer boy. He's been my rock, and I, and I take shelter in him. Yeah, Uksiv, and it's a further Posik in Tilim. Actually, this is an earlier Posik in Tilim in Capital Hay at the end. Uksiv cuts in like a shield. Yeah, his will has. Uh, and, cr- and crowned me. Ta- turns from the word atora, meaning a crown. So here we notice clearly the like the doubling of the metaphor. Uh, he says turi, and then he says ex boy. Uh, he's like my rock. Now a rock is something that normally, in order to to um, use it as a you know a defensive mechanism in war, the Ebenezer ones over there to get up on a rock, and since you're higher, then others can't get on you because you're not. Or you can say that you hide behind the rock and it like protects you from uh, the flying uh, arrows or other uh, things which might be thrown at you. Over here, it appears to be implied like two things. Uh, the Indian of a, 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 a exer is the idea of taking shelter inside something. So maybe we could say that's two, the two levels we mentioned. Tsuri 
Okay, that's a, like a near thing which protects me in a simple way, but that's the union of Chokmosa in Spora. That's the union of understanding Torah, the way Torah comes to us in a way of Gilui, of understanding. That in if an boy, I will take shelter, and Rashi says, but eskasevoy, and I'll cover myself with it. That's what's written in Rashi over there. Or we can say that that's the inner for mitzvahs, but they come on us in the form of a makif, who we devote ourselves to Rats and Hashem without, without understanding of Kabbalah soil. That's the inner of the mitzvahs. And, and that's the inner of the two churis on the one hand, the, what we might call the inner of a korib shibah, a Torah mitzvah. That's chok mosay, that's the understanding we have in Torah. Ex is boy is the inner of the makif in mitzvahs. And that would be the same with the next thing, katsino. Yeah, it's like a, a shield, then rots and teatrenu, then the avis is rots and, and crowns me like a crown. But that we can just the two in on him. Tzina is like the, you know, the understanding of the Torah, and teatrenu is like the crown from the Kabbalah soil of the Mitzvahs. I mean, that would make sense then why the Alter Rebbe, in, first, in the first part of the Torah, uh, it's a chemistry. He meant to say that that parcel leads us eventually through the ter- to, to the Abisha. But he said it goes in two specific levels, which would be the reason why he needs to bring you know, the further Pesukim and not just to be, uh, uh, to rely. Uh, and then he, which is uh, why he brings all three Pesukim that's brought down in certain forms that we could say that's connected, Makshav and Dibu and Maisa. And that maybe there's a, a, a hint in that last Pesukim more like Abhi Dominion from Makshova, that if you actually do, I'm sorry, uh, Misa, to actually do something, then you've made like a, a shield for yourself, the, the thing is like a, a, an act and a deed in the physical world, and then it crowns you. Like we see, uh, like it, 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 it follows in life that uh, if you learn and study Torah, but you, you, you keep the mitzvahs as a result of your study of the Torah, then your life becomes according to the way the, the mitzvahs, as it were, like teach you, and they cause the Torah becomes like part of your life. Once it becomes part of your life, you you begin to do all of your actions according to the Torah. You act in a way that you are a Torah person. And remember, that comes because you devote yourself to the mitzvahs, because you give yourself away for Kabbalah Seher. Then the chokmah that you gain in Torah becomes an enveloping thing in your whole life. And that's what we suggested. The altar of his ending here with those extra uh, pesukim. Anyway, he said, "Who retaini v'chok mosei?" Oh, those are the two levels. Yeah, retaini v'chok mosei. That you've got both a uh, inyan which is connected uh, uh, and parallel to the inyan from chokma, and then you have a further inyan which is uh, I, why does why doesn't they say chok mosei v'retaini? Because here he's talking about the the necessity to be given away to everything, both Chokmah and Torah, both Torah and Mitzvah, you have to be given away that it's all routine. Well, the Ika is the Bittl to retain it, then you get all these results yeah, in your life. Retaining of Chokmah, she is Barak, Anubashim, what they are enclosed in the Torah and the, in the Mitzvah. And through that enclosement, then we become Torah as Hashem, then we come become bottled to the essence of a Kodesh Baruch himself. And that's what he goes on to say uh, now a little bit more powerfully in the coming Hemshech of the uh, other Perry. Now we want to mention that this Shia today was the uh, Shus, it was um, for the Shus of? Mendel ben, Mendel ben Shmuel. Chaim? Mendel ben Shmuel. Mendel ben? Shmuel. Ben Shmuel. Yeah. Uh, uh, Mendel Ben Shmuel. Yeah. You wouldn't know the mother's name. Mm. No, Mendel Ben Shmuel. But that's where the, 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 so this lesson yeah. was Muktash Le Zichrei Ve Aliyah Snishmoth.